is Word Hero any good? I'm a full-time blogger and I use AI writers like Jasper, like Copymatic, like Word Hero to help me generate content. And I'm in the dashboard right now, my dashboard for Word Hero. I wanna give you a quick overview of Word Hero and show you an example of how to write a blog post with it to, to let you know if it's any good. Is it good for bloggers, beginners? Is it good for affiliate marketers? Is it good, is it good for professionals? Well, let's check that out. First of all, I have some of these templates already pinned, ones that are more important to me. You might pin something different. Um, so I like blog paragraphs, explain it to a child. So summarize it, make it more simple. Fictional story narration, it's pretty cool that you can write not only blog posts, but emails, social media, even stories, short stories, fan fiction, even novels or nonfiction books with AI writers like Word Hero. Listicles, that's pretty cool for a blogger. Blog headlines, yep, like titles. Blog outlines, you can auto-generate an outline, you can create an intro, conclusions, and you can write paragraphs, so all of the body of the content as well. A couple other things that I really like is this example provider. You can enter a vague statement and Word Hero is gonna create an example to help you justify it, support it. And as it says, you need to fact check that. That's true of all the AI writers. You have to fact check them, guide them, fact check them and edit them, insert some of your humanness into the content um, to make it a lot better. And of course, if you're into copywriting, marketing, um, there's lots of stuff for that. There's book descriptions, book titles, um, analogy provider, that's pretty cool for any kind of writing, come up with some brand names. If you wanna rewrite con content, that's good. I'm actually gonna pin that. Um, emails, if you do any kind of emails uh, marketing or just write emails, that would be great correct your grammar, do Google ads, let's keep going, um, create uh, lead magnets. If you're wanting to do uh, copywriting, like I said, product reviews, product names, product descriptions, product stories, all great for affiliate marketing um, and for e-commerce stores. You can, if you're into Quora or Reddit or just answering forum type questions, that could be helpful. Expand your sentences. Um, there's SEO stuff. There's a sales page guarantee headlines, um, creating sales page intros or openers, um, slogans, value propositions, things for YouTube and website about us pages. So there's all kinds of templates on here and they're even updating this some more. You can see there's business, marketing, social media, writing tools and just miscellaneous. What I really wanna show you is, is Word Hero any good, particularly for writing? Now you can write essays, you can write emails, you can write reports, you can write blog posts, articles, and stories, like I said. So let's go in here and see if we can't write a blog. So here you go, guys. Now I'm in this editor, which is the long form. I actually have the premium version of Word Hero. There's a, a basic version, which gives you access to most, if not all of these templates. And then this long form editor or writer is what I'm in right now. And that's the little bit more expensive one. We'll go over the pricing um, before we get done with this video. And there is actually some special pricing depending on when you are watching this video. I'm going to write a blog post about how I make $5,000 each month by mirror blogging, something that I'm already working on. I like to feed the tool some content that seems to work no matter what kind of tool you're doing. Um, as you can see, you can use different things like blog paragraphs. Um, you can write more, which will just tell the editor to write you some more information. Um, so right now what I'm going to do is use this blog outline. I'm going to go ahead and put all of this in here. Let's see if I can fit it all in. I'm going to say write for me. Let's see what it does. Basics of mere blogging, identifying the right keywords, um, creating compelling content, optimizing, promoting your content, tracking your results. We're going to do introduction, copied. Let's put it right here. I'm just going to now say, hey, write this introduction for me. See, it's already doing this for me. I'm just simply clicking a few buttons and it's giving me words. So that's pretty awesome. And by the way, when you have um, the unlimited version, um, you can actually create as many words as you want. Look, I'm already at 137 words. What has it been like a minute? So I'm not gonna do a deep dive into uh, each word that it created for me, uh, but this is pretty good. Bogging, one of the simplest and most profitable ways is mirror 
other bloggers content. So that's true. That's pretty close to what I'm talking about. This means copying and pasting someone else's blog on your own website without providing. Uh, that's actually not what, <laughs> what I'm talking about. So we're going to stop that right there and give the tool a little bit more information about what, what I actually mean. This is really about creating similar type of content on related keywords. So it could be mirroring another blogger's content in terms of their content structure and outline. And it could even mean like their topics, but definitely not copying and pasting their words. That is plagiarism and <laughs> I don't support that. Um, and neither will Google. So don't do that. Like all the options you have here. So I'm going to ask the tool to continue writing about this same kind of idea. So it's talking about uh, being blogging being time consuming, which is great empathy. Now that I've showed you how to guide the tool a little bit and created a little bit of content here, let me show you how to pull in the other templates from the side here to show you how to use these in the long form editor. Now I love using these very targeted and concise blog paragraph tools across different AI writers. It gives you about 47 characters to describe what you want the paragraph to be about. So you have to be really concise. One of the things I like about some other AI tools like Jasper is that it gives you up to like 800 characters to talk about what it is that you want to write. And also down here, you can put some keywords. The good news is because you have to be so concise with word hero, you're going to have to really focus in on what you want this paragraph to be about, which actually helps you create a more focused content. So let's give it a try. Let's say examples of keyword clusters. And I'm just going to say, hey, write for me. OK, here we go. When creating a website, important to use keywords that will help your site rank. Clusters, group of keywords that are related to each other. So this is good. This is I can actually add this in here. Ice cream, ice cream flavors, homemade ice cream, ice cream toppings. Yep, that's good. Help you come up with new content ideas. Okay, so I'm going to say yes, I like that. I'm going to copy it. And I'm actually going to paste this down in here. Let's see what it comes up with this time. So I'm going to say I like that. And you're still going to have to do a little bit of editing here. But you see how I like the targeted um, content there. I think that works really well. And you can just go down and do each one of your subheadings as this blog paragraph and then tie it right in um, to your whole blog post. Let me show you a, a couple of these other templates just so you know what they can do. Let's go to the example provider. Blogging is a great side hustle. And let's see what example it gives me. I started a blog as titles and has turned to a full-time job. That actually is true for me. I started a blog a few months ago and it's been a great side hustle. I've been able to make a little bit of money. So those two are great examples. I'll say that, but that's the one I would use. You copy it, you paste it into whatever it is that you want, um, wherever you want to write that, whether that's on social media or your blog post. Now let's try this analogy provider. So I think this could be really useful for blog posts, emails, short stories, essays even. So let's see what it comes up with. Love is risky. Love is like a roller coaster ride. This is a common analogy. It's exciting and thrilling, but it can also be scary. Um, love is risky, like jumping out of an airplane without a parachute. Okay, it's thrilling and exciting, but there's a chance that you might get hurt or killed. Uh, I might change the ending of it, but I like the jumping out of the air, airplane one without a parachute. I think it's a little bit less common of an analogy, and I could use that. Before we go, I did want to go over the pricing. As you can see, this is the Word Hero website. Per month, it's going to cost you around $49, but you can create unlimited content with that $49 per month. Some other AI writers go all the way up to 100 or more dollars per month, and they're not always unlimited. So this is a good deal for an AI writer. You can generate tons of articles, blog posts, social media posts, whatever it is you write with this price. Now that is per month. If you pay per year, you actually get it at a lower rate, this $29 per month, which is Gosh, that's such a deal. If you're basically paying about half that if you do it in a yearly um, payment. So those are the pricing fees. I would say go ahead and check this out. At least do it for a month um, or two. See how it works for you. And you can always cancel it if you don't like it. But if you're like me, you find these AI tools completely necessary and essential to your 
business and into your life, whether you're a student, a blogger, or a marketer. So check those out. There will be a link in the description so that you can go ahead and get this for yourself and try it out. Guys, I hope this gave you at least a taste of what Word Hero can do for you. It's actually a pretty cool program, pretty good um, AI writer that I would suggest you try out if you're looking into one. Um, there will be a link in the description so that you can check this out for yourself. That's all for today's video. Make sure you like and subscribe. Let me know in the comments if you made it here to the end. And if you have any questions about Word Hero or other AI writers like Word Hero. Thanks for watching. I'll see you at the next video.